the whole good dick day thing that came about because the insta hoes talk about their beautiful hair and they're able to fucking throw it around and luscious and girls are like look at my great hair day and then they'd be like, man, great tit day or great this day, great butt day. Guys really don't do that. But no one. Like, what are we supposed to do? Supposed no one to... supports the homies. So what I was saying was that was like my thing. Like who says like, dude, there's days whenever my dick just looks 10 times better than it normally does. Slap and thigh. If I get the chance to slap thigh that day, I'm pumped. <laughs> I am fucking. I'm definitely engaging in slapping thigh. You look like you walked in. You look like you had big dick energy today. Today, yeah, I feel it. Full, full, thick. thick. It just looks great. Yeah. Good. And like when you put your underwear on, you feel special about yourself. You're like, fuck, do you look good today? Yeah. Like you can't go online and be like, man, I mean, fucking you- feeling it today. Because think of the confidence boost for the women whenever they have a good hair day. Like, look at these fucking locks shoving their hair and shit. You're like, bitch, that hair fucks. You're like, yeah. But then what do we get to say? Nothing. I can't fucking show Instagram videos I mean, of my dick. you can dick. show me your dick. I'd tell you, that's a great dick day. I but appreciate like, it. But no one... Like, but like, we, I, like we the don't masses norm- of people. Yeah, but we don't normalize like telling the homies, nice dick. Like, everybody is scared of that conversation. Like, we want to talk about removing dicks. We want to talk about doing all this shit. But we can't walk up to the homie and be like, hey, Don, nice that's dick. a nice dick. Good work. Today. Like, good work today. Yeah. Like, you woke up feeling energized, didn't you, bud? It's not gay. Yeah. It's not gay. It's not fucking gay. It's mm-hmm. very complimental. Like, it's complimenting. We're in an age where it's like, bro, if you can suck a dick and still not be gay, <laughs> I can talk about your dick and say you got a nice dick. Yep. That's a great point. <laughs> <clears throat> fucking quote me. Oh. I, I, I especially appreciate when, like, like Kim actually notices the good dick day. Oh, isn't and, that the best? And she I wakes will, up. Oh God, and I want to be Kim right now. I will. I will say this too. I, I position myself on those days that she will see it. That it's a good day. Oh yeah. Like the way I like just like uh, like open the leg. Like when I'm getting dressed, just like right in the corner of the mirror. That she doesn't even know she can actually see me over hey, there, but she's like... Every single yeah. guy and every single female of a significant other knows what a good dick day is. They just don't talk about it. Yeah. Yeah. And, we're and any it. type of guy, any guy that has a good dick day, like you said, like just the way you, you, you position yourself, the way you swing it around. Yeah. Like, oh, like, when do I ever fucking get out of the shower like this all sexually? We're going to normalize this. I think it's important because I don't to. think we vocalize this. We want to vocalize every other fucking shit we have feelings about. Why don't we vocalize men's good dick day? It should be a day. national holiday. I I think so. 